This video has been suggested from this comment. So remember to like and comment on my videos so that your song suggestion may become the next piano lesson. Also, only about 10% of you who watch my lessons are subscribed, so if you enjoyed or learned something from this video, please consider subscribing. It's free and you can always undo it later. Anyway, let's get right into the lesson. Hello guys, this is Amos Style Music and in today's lesson, I'm going to teach you how to play It's a Beautiful Day by the Kipnis Rushorn. Okay, so give you a preview of this beautiful song, it goes like this, check it out. Alright, let's get right into it. Melody and block chords, that's the foundation, and afterwards you can add your own improvisations and decoration patterns to make your own version. Alright, let's get right into it. Break it up into a few parts, it's easy to learn, so break it up to four parts, okay? First part, right hand starts at the C, middle C, C here for reference, we go up an octave to this C, so it goes C, 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 D, C, up to G, E, C, D, C, G. That's it for the right hand for the first part, let's learn it once again, so it goes C, 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 D, C, G, E, C, D, C, G. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, we have two chords. They are C major, which is C, E, G, and the fully white note chord. Second chord is G major, which is G, B, D. With these two chords in mind, C major, followed by G major. Turn together, it goes like this. The right hand starts. After G, C major by itself. Right hand continues. After G, G major by itself. That's it for the first part. All right, let's learn it once again. So it goes. Yeah. Yeah. Moving on to the second part. Right continues. It goes C, D, C, G, G, F, E, D. That's it for the right hand for the second part. Let's learn it again. So it goes C, D, C, G, G, F, E, D. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, we have two chords, they are A minor, which is A, C, E, and second chord is F major, which is F, A, C. So with these two chords in mind, so A minor and F major, the two ends together goes like this, so right hand starts. After G, A minor by itself, right hand continues. After D, F major by itself. That's it. Let's learn it once again, so it goes... Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Back to back, the two parts we've learned so far will be played like this. Beautiful. Moving on to the third part, right hand continues, it goes D, E, D, C, C, up to G, E, D, C, A. That's it for the third part for the right hand, let's learn it again, it goes D, E, D, C, C, up to G, E, D, C, A. That's it for the right hand. Left hand we have two chords, they are C major, which is C, G, and, and G major, which is G, B, D. So these two chords in mind, so C major and G major, the two hands together goes like this, so right hand starts. After G, C major by itself. After A, G major by itself. Like that. There you go. So. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. So back to back, the three parts of Blunt so far will be played like this. Moving on to the fourth and last part, right continues, goes D, E, D, C, C, G, E, D, C, A flat. That's it for the right hand. Let's learn it once again. So it goes D, E, D, C, C, G, E, D, C, A flat. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, we have two chords, A minor, which is A, C, E, and an F minor, which is F, A flat, C. So with these two chords in mind, so A minor and F minor, the two hands together goes like this. So right hand starts. After G, A minor by itself. After A flat, F minor by itself. That's it. Let's learn it again. It goes. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. So back to back, all four parts of this lesson will be played like this, and you just loop it.
准备。Beautiful. So once you get the melody and chords all good, you can start to add your own improvisations to make your own version. So left hand, you can do like octave bass, octaves and arpeggios, rhythmic patterns. Yeah, something like that. Play around with it. And the right hand, you can harmonize on the chords to make it thicker in texture. It's going to be like... Yeah, play around, have fun with this beautiful tune. So I hope you enjoyed this lesson, by the way. If you want to learn other beautiful tunes like this, search up your favorite song name, followed by Amos Doll in the YouTube search to find those other lessons to learn for yourself. But as for now, that's pretty much it for today's lesson. If you enjoyed this lesson, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally there are multiple thousands and thousands of these videos ranging from pop songs of all languages, meme songs, video game music, movie, anime, and cartoon theme songs, and many more songs of all sorts that I teach. So most likely you can find your favorite song to learn on my channel. Also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. Learn from my piano courses on how to play by ER, improvise, read sheet music, how to play and sing, and many more courses at all types of levels, even for those who have never touched a piano before. As for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.